Hi, I'm Karina Heinrich, lifestyle and wellness expert, and I can't wait to share all my fun, easy, creative, and totally awesome Mother's Day activities. Whether the sun is shining or you're stuck inside, you're sure to be celebrated. Well, Mother's Day is a week away, but today we've got some great ways for you to celebrate mom, whether the sun is shining or if bad weather forces you indoors. Lifestyle coach Karina Heinrich joins us now. And good morning, Karina. Good Hi morning. Well. Thanks for having me. Yeah, great to have you and your special guest as well. And we <laughs> love seeing you outdoors. And we yes. actually have heard that there's ways that uh, we can celebrate mothers uh, be with some of the great activities outside. So what do you have in mind? Yes, as a mom of three, I have a lot of favorites. I love getting brown flower pots made from recyclable materials that me and the kids can decorate and then actually plant some bright spring flowers together in them. Brings out their creativity and such a beautiful keepsake that you can replant each year. If you have older kids, it's really nice to put together a flower arranging class too. Pick flowers up from your local farmer's market for fresher, locally grown flowers with less of a carbon footprint. And this year, classes can can be done virtually. So if mom doesn't live with you and you're long distance, you can still have your own Mother's Day flowers to show off at the end. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. You can always Zoom with mom <laughs> as well. Well, exactly. with the warmer weather and actually a few more people getting vaccinated, more families are actually going outside. So if you've got some yes. great eco-friendly things that will make for some beautiful memories. Yes, yeah, so gardeners know that Mother's Day is the perfect time to start planting seeds. So get the whole family outside, digging in the dirt. And every time mom sees the garden, she's reminded of her special day. So it's that gift that keeps on giving. And if you live somewhere in the country where you can pick strawberries, which I know Sky mm. absolutely loves, mm. this activity is especially fun if you have kids who want to get in on the action. Also, going to that farmer's market on the weekend can be amazing. Picking fresh in-season spring produce, such as apricots, avocados, avocados, grapefruit, kiwis, strawberries, mango, arugula, asparagus, parsley. The list is endless. Yeah, I took my kids uh, strawberry picking, teenagers, in fact, last year, and they <laughs> loved it. So it's a great thing for so fun. all ages. Yeah, it is. So Mother Nature can also be pretty fickle. She can force us yes. to go inside instead of what we had planned outside. So what are some suggestions for indoor activities? Yeah, absolutely. So you can put a tarp down on a covered patio inside, set up some blank canvases. If you have kids at home, give them a theme to paint for mom like my kids did last night. I have two masterpieces over there using environmentally <laughs> safe paints. If, some, if everyone's over 21, sign yourself up for a virtual painting class, sampling of organic wines you may not have tried before. Put together a beautiful creation to remember the day. All right. Well, those sound like <laughs> wonderful things and beautiful paintings as well. So thank you so much, Karina, for joining us this morning. And again, Mother's thank Day you. is just one week away. Yes.